Hello everyone, welcome back to Pabli. So in this video, we are going to learn how to create get response contact from Instagram lead ad leads. So here I'm running a business and to promote my business, I'm running an Instagram lead ad. So in this case, I want whenever a new lead is generated, automatically using that lead details, a new contact should be created in my get response account. So to automate this process, we will use an automation software named as Pabli Connect in which we need to connect our trigger and our action. So in this process, our trigger application will be Instagram lead ads and our action application will be get response. So to learn this process step by step, let me take you to my screen. Welcome to my screen. So in this video, we are going to learn how to add your Instagram lead ads leads to get response as a new contact. So here you can see this is my Instagram account and I have connected my Instagram account with my Facebook page as well. So this here is my Facebook page and here I'm going to show you that I have connected my Facebook page with my Instagram account successfully. So for that here I'm going to take you to my settings and now scrolling down here under permissions I'm going to select linked accounts and here you can see I have successfully connected my Instagram account with my Facebook page. So using this Facebook page, I'm running some Instagram lead ads through which I'm generating new leads. So this here is the campaign which I've created. And now here I want whenever a new lead is generated in my Instagram lead ad, automatically that lead should be added as a contact in my get response account. So now to automate this process, we will use an automation software named as Pabli Connect. This is the homepage of Pabli Connect. You can visit this page by simply browsing for the URL pabli.com slash connect. Here you can see two options that are sign in and sign up free. If you're a new user, click on sign up free and get free 100 tasks every month to explore the software and if you're an existing user click on sign in here i'm an existing user so i'm clicking on sign in after signing in you can see all pabli apps window where you can see all the applications of pabli here to integrate my applications i'm going to use pabli connect this is the dashboard of Pabli Connect. Here you can see a create workflow button on the top right corner so here to create a new workflow i'm going to click on this button now here in this create workflow dialog box, we have to give a name to our workflow. So here I'm going to give the name as create get response contact from Instagram lead at leads. And here I'm going to select my folder as automations. You can select your folder as per your need. Also, you can create multiple folders to save your workflows accordingly. And now to create a new workflow, I'm going to click on this create button. Now here you can see we have successfully created a workflow with the name create get response contact from Instagram lead at leads. And here in this workflow window, you can see two most important principles of an automation process that are trigger and action. Where trigger says when this happens and action says do this. That means action is a response towards a trigger. Your automation can have a single trigger but multiple action steps. Now let's begin with our automation by simply setting up a trigger. So here I'm going to select my trigger application as Instagram lead ads and my trigger event as new lead instance so that whenever a new lead is generated in my Instagram lead ads, instantly Pabli Connect should capture the response. And now to connect my Instagram lead ads with Pabli Connect, here I'm going to click on this connect. Here to build a new connection, I'm going to select add new connection. If your Instagram lead ads account is already connected with Pabli Connect, then you can click on select existing connection. And now here to build a new connection, I'm going to click on this connect with Instagram lead ads. So here to build a connection, it requires the Facebook account or a Facebook page. So here, as I have mentioned earlier that my Instagram account is already connected with my Facebook page. So here I'm going to select my Facebook account for the same and authorization successful. And now as you can see our Instagram lead ads account is successfully connected with Pabli Connect. So now moving forward and here it is asking me to select the page. So here I've already shown you my Facebook page which is named as Peak Performance Physio. So here in my Pabli window, here I'm going to search my page as Peak Performance Physio. And now after selecting the page, here it is asking me to select the Legion form. So here in my campaign, I have already created an instant form with the name Instagram Lead Ads. 
so here i'm going to use my lead gen form which is named as instagram lead ads so here in my pabli window i'm going to select my lead gen form as instagram lead ads so here i've selected a single form because i want only the leads of this form should be captured by pabli connect but if you want the leads of all the forms should be captured by pabli connect then you can select all lead gen forms now moving forward here i'm going to click on save and send test request and here you can see as it is waiting for webhook response that means here to receive a webhook response we need to do a test submission and to do a test submission we need to generate a new lead in our instagram lead ads so here taking you to my meta ads manager here you can see this campaign is in draft mode that means this campaign is not a live campaign so as this is not a live campaign so here i'm going to generate a test lead to show you the response but if you are running any live campaign then also you have to follow the same steps and whenever you are going to receive a new lead in your instagram lead ad then automatically it will get captured in pabli connect so as here my campaign is in draft mode so here i'm going to generate a test lead using meta lead ads testing tool so that i can get a response here so here to generate a new test lead using lead ads testing tool by meta so here under meta for developers this is a lead ads testing tool and here i've selected my page and my form to generate a new lead using this lead ads testing tool so here to generate a new lead i'm going to click on this preview form so here i've entered a dummy detail where i've entered the first name as demo last name as user email as demo at the rate pabletudes.com random phone number and company name as tesla and now here i'm going to click on this next and then submit and here you can see it says your test lead has been sent so now let's move back to our pabli window and here you can see we have successfully received a response where we have received first name last name email phone number company name and other details so with this we have successfully set up our trigger Now let's move to action step. Here I'm going to select my action application as get response and my action event as create a contact. And now to connect my get response with Pabli Connect, here I'm going to click on this connect. Again here to build a new connection, I'm going to select add new connection. If your get response account is already connected with Pabli Connect, then you can click on select existing connection. And now here to build a new connection, it is asking for API key. And here in instruction it says enter your API key. You can find your API key from here. So here I'm going to click on this. and here you can see it has taken us to the api window so here it easily took us to api window because i was already logged in in my get response account so to get easy connection make sure you are already logged in in your get response account and from here i'm going to click on this generate api key and here i'm going to give a name to my api key that is instagram lead ads and now i'm going to click on this generate and here you can see i have successfully generated a api key so here i'm going to copy this Moving back to Pabli window, here I'm going to paste my API key. Now, after entering the API key, here I'm going to click on the Save, and here you can see we have successfully connected our Get Response account with Pabli Connect. So now moving forward, here it is asking me to select a campaign which is a required fee. So here in my Get Response account, I have already created four campaign list with different names. So here in this case, I'm going to use the list which is named as Pabli List. So moving back to Pabli window, here I'm going to select the campaign list as Pabli List. So here I've selected this list because I want all the leads which are created in my Instagram lead ads should be added as a new contact under my list which is named as Pabli List. So now moving forward, here it is asking me to enter the name. So here instead of entering data manually, here I will map the data. Data. Mapping data means insert data from previous step. That means here I will map the data from the response I have received in my Instagram lead ads. Mapping makes our text dynamic so that whenever a new lead is generated in my Instagram lead ads, automatically this previously existing lead details will be updated with the new one. So here I am going to map the name. Here I am going to select the first name, space, last name. Moving forward, here I am going to map the email. moving forward here this ip address day of cycle are not a required field so here i'm going to leave them blank moving forward and now it is asking for tag id so here in my tag id i'm going to select pc as my tag id because this tag id is connected to my campaign list which i have selected moving forward now again here birth date city comment are not a required field so here i'm going to leave them blank but if you want to add any other details then you can do it as per your need moving forward here i'm going to map the company 
again moving forward all these fields are not required so here i'm going to leave them blank but if you want then you can add the values as per your need moving forward here i'm going to map the phone number and again i'm going to leave all these fields blank and now i'm going to click on save and send test request and here you can see we have successfully received a response where the message is contact already added. So now let me take you to my get response account. And here under public list in contacts, you can see we have successfully created a new contact with the email as demo at the rate publitudes.com and name as demo user. So with this, we have successfully set up our automation. Now let's test our automation to check whether it is working or not. So to test our automation, we need to generate another test lead. And for that, let me take you back to my lead at testing tool. So here under lead edge testing tool, I need to delete my previous lead in order to create a new one. Because it says you can create one lead per form, you will need to delete an existing lead in order to create a new one. So here to delete my existing lead, I'm going to click on this delete lead. And then I'm going to refresh my window and that's a necessary step. So now again here in lead edge testing tool, the page and form is selected. And now to generate a new lead, I'm going to click on this preview form. So again here I've entered another dummy data where I've entered first name as test, last name as user, email as test at the rate publitudes.com, a random phone number and company name as Tesla. So here I'm going to click on this next and then submit. And here you can see again it says your test lead has been sent. So now let me take you back to my get response account. And here you can see we have successfully created another new contact with the email address as test at the rate publitudes.com and name as test user. So with this we have successfully tested our automation. Now let me summarize this whole video for you. So here we have taken our trigger as Instagram lead ads and our action as get response. So that whenever a new lead is generated in an Instagram lead ads account, automatically and instantly using that details, a new contact should be created in a get response account. If you want to use the same workflow, then you can find the clone link in the description box below. I hope you liked the video. Thanks for watching. Not only these applications, you can integrate many other applications with Pabli Connect. If you have any doubt, you can contact us on support at zaritpabli.com. If you have any query, you can contact us on forum.pabli.com. And if you have any pricing related issue, then you can contact us on www.pabli.com. If you like the video, please subscribe to our channel and share it with your friends.